Hi hey guys, in this video we are going to see an SAT editor which is uh, access an IDE and allow you to write your auto IT scripts. It almost looks similar to Notepad but it comes with various features uh, like uh, uh, it will display your uh, auto IT functions and user defined functions and uh, statements and keywords etc. when you type the first letter and this is usually we call it as IntelliSense. It has pre-built IntelliSense inside it and uh, let's see how to write your script and compile the script and build an exe file using this SAT editor. To do that first open the SAT editor. Go to start all programs auto IT v3 in this you can find a folder called SEIT editor. Click on this folder, launch this SAT application. See this is the SAT applications and it comes with a menu, a oh, lot of menus. Let's write our first script in this message box is our first script. Message box is a function of auto IT which will allow you to display a message hello welcome to my youtube channel yeah we just wrote a simple script message box is zero zero indicate the type of button you want to display in the message box and hello is the title of this message welcome to youtube is a prompt for this message box for save the script go to file save I'm going to save it in auto it notes as first script I've saved that and go to this tools option syntax checker before giving this compile and build you should check first syntax error click on the syntax check it has checked the syntax and it doesn't display any error value so we are good to compile the script if any error is exists in the script then it will be displayed under this for example i'm deleting this double quotes one of the double quotes i'm deleting and i am checking the syntax check see it's get error with an illegal character so go to this and I am adding the double quotes again checking the syntax yeah it is finished go to these tools and compile it it will ask for do you want to convert it into exe or a3x of course we want exe because we need the script as a standalone application click on this compile script it is compiling and your exe will be generated in the same path where you have saved this a3 file just go to that path this is the first script and uh, this is an application which is generated click on this application you can find the message box welcome to youtube channel also you can build this once you have fully written the scripts this uh, build is almost similar to this compile but uh, usually you will use this option after you have completed everything in the script because uh, for compile you can use it to check the functionality of the script but uh, once you click on this build uh, it will be considered as the final product uh, now we almost completed everything so we can check this build as well created a first script.exe this build will override the already created ax application see it gets overwritten and if you click on this you get same result so there is not a much difference between the build and the compile the only difference is Use this build once you have completed the script and use the compile option when you are testing the functionality of the script. That's it. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe.